today we would like to show you some exercises which you can do on the back, on your back on the rebounder. These are exercises which I like very much, for instance, when I'm tired, you know, and uh, I don't feel like oh, really rebounding oh. now. Uh, <laughs> or you do it, which is also very nice, you do it at the end of your session, at the end of a rebounding session. That's, that's mostly when I'm using it, basically. But uh, I know it from people, you know, who work the whole day in an office and then they come home and then they don't feel like directly going into bouncing. And with that, you immediately get back energy and then afterwards you really feel like, now yeah, I want to bounce. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So we start with an exercise which is called basketball. So Jana, if you could lay down and you see the feet are nicely on the ground. You, you put your head in a way that it is comfortable for you. You can also put a pillow under the head, you know. And spe specifically for those of you who are uh, taller, you know, you will lay now with your head a little bit more on the edge of the rebounder. In that case, you take a small pillow and then it gets comfort comfortable also. And from there, you come in a bouncing of your bit. Okay, that's great. And that's called basketball. And you do it in a way that is really comfortable and you can relax. You can also use the arms and you can put the arms up and just like... Oh, let go. Ooh, ah, 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 ah. Exactly. I'm going to let it go. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> and have fun with it. Exactly. Okay, and then come to a standstill. We do the exercises now not in the full length, so you can do it longer. And uh, from there, we uh, do a stretching. We call it the Felix the Cat. Big stretch all over the rebounder. And yawn if you want to yawn and stretch, stretch, stretch. Oh, yeah. Great, 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 great. And from there you can bring up the legs and the arms in an upright position. Exactly. And that bounce here, that's the beetle on the back. Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you can movement. You can do not only movement, also sound. You can bounce. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, great, great. Exactly, and just let it go. That's nice. That very much is a very, very relaxing exercise. And then see what Adriana is doing. You come in a cradling position. You can give yourself a little bit of massage of the spine while doing that. See, these are exercises which you can basically also do on the floor, but it is much nicer on a rebounder because it doesn't hurt you because the mat is giving. And then... Usually what I'm doing from there is I just follow my body. When the body wants this stretch, I do that, this stretch. And when the body wants that, I do that, you know. So that's, that's up to you. But in the end, what we do is uh, that we come in this position and we do a rocking chair, like rocking backs and forth, until we come in a sitting position. And that's how we end the back exercises. Thank you, Diana. Okay. So now you know what you can do when you come home from work and you're very tired and you need a quick boost of energy. As I said before, we did not show you the exercises in the full length, so you can do each of the different movements for at least a minute, and you can also do the whole set of movements, one after the other, put it together like a routine, and do this routine several times, one after the other. And don't forget, listen to your body. Your body knows exactly what you need and your body will tell you what he wants to curl up or to stretch, you know, whatever, whatever you feel. Really just go for it. So we come to the end of this show and uh, I want to sh thank you all who have participated lately in leaving comments or who have written in the blog which we started. Uh, it's really, really great to read that and uh, as you see from other comments that people really love to listen to what you have to say. And today we start a new question on the blog. Today's question is, what is the greatest benefit you get from rebounding? And I'm very curious to listen what you have to say. I wish you a great week. Bounce in good health.